Hi, I'm Alan Henseroth, and welcome to the Lenaway Express, Arapahoe Basin's brand new high-speed detachable six-pack. This is actually the fourth lift in the Lenaway zone. The first one went in the 60s, it was a platter lift, it went to Lenaway Parks, it was beautiful. That was so good, by 74 we added the Lenaway double chair, which went to the eastern side of the summit. That was a great lift in 2001. We went with the Lenaway Triple, which went to the very tip top, so it served the whole part of the upper mountain. And now this year, 2022, we've added the six passenger Lenaway Express, which services almost all the terrain at Arapahoe Basin. The Lenaway Triple is a bit nostalgic for me. It was the first major project that I was the manager for, and it was a good lift, but pretty quickly we found out we needed something even bigger. And we listened to what our guests were telling us, they wanted a detachable lift, they wanted a faster lift, and they wanted us to get rid of the lines. And so we put in the Lenaway Express detachable high-speed lift. Most fixed grip chair lifts, like the Lenaway Triple, have a, a lifespan of 40 or 50 years. We retired it after only 21 years, but we've repurposed it. It's heading to Sunlight Mountain Resort down near Glenwood Springs, and it's gonna have a good long life down there. The new lift features 2,400 people per hour. It's a high-speed detached six-pack. The comfort of the chair and the wind is gonna be improved. So the new Lenaway chair has shaved about four minutes off the ride time from the bottom to the top. The old Len chair took just over eight minutes and we're looking at four on this one. The new lift has a bunch of improved safeties and redundancies and the skiing experience I think is gonna be enhanced by this new product. This definitely solves a lot of issues for us on the operational side. As many of you know from skiing here in the past, uh, we get backed up here. This is one of our main lifts. You can get to all the skiing on the hill. From here you can get to Zoom Bowl, Beavers, you can start hiking up the wall. It's really critical that we move people through this area. I, I use this analogy, I have no idea if it makes sense or not. This and the Black Mountain Express are our interstate systems. This is where we need to move people along. And then we got the state highways where you can sit back and relax and, and enjoy the ride a little bit. Beavers, Zuma, Polly. This thing, moving people uphill is gonna help us a ton down here. So the Lenaway Express here at Arapahoe Base in the summer presented a lot of challenges. First of all is the terrain. We have alpine tundra, we have some wetlands. So we flew all our line equipment in with a helicopter and the winds here and the weather patterns are quite unique and challenging for helicopter operations. But we battled through that day, got it in successfully. Some of the other challenges are moving the top terminal to the top of the mountain. Real steep, real narrow roads. The weather this summer was also a challenge. As you well know, we had a nice wet summer, which we're thankful for, but did create some problems. Overall, this lift is a great success as an installation, and I think it's really gonna serve the community in Arapahoe Basin for many, many years to come. So Lenaway Express, that's virtually sitting on the same spot as the old Lenaway lift. To get the new one in and to accommodate the larger footprint of this terminal, we had to do a ton of earthwork back there. So it started with removing the old lift, digging 40 foot down, removing all of that material and beginning to import material and all the blocks, the Lego blocks in this wall you've heard us talking about, bringing all that material in. A couple kind of wild numbers here. The blocks alone, 1.3 million pounds of blocks go into this wall behind us. And then again, we removed all that dirt and replaced it with structural backfill sand and wash rock, uh, that's over 6,000 tons of material just there. So logistically, getting all that material out, bringing it all back up has been really challenging and kudos to everybody involved for pulling this off and making it happen. Phil and his team build phenomenal lifts. We couldn't have done this without Phil and his dedication. All the support staff behind the scenes at Lightner Palma, but man, you build good lifts and you make it happen. Thank you, Louie. This is the th third project I myself from Leitner Poma, the project manager has done with Louie and the team here at Arapahoe Basin. Always an enjoyable experience. It's a seamless interaction of two groups and teams working together to accomplish putting in this lift. And it's always enjoyable working with your friends and your colleagues and really getting stuff done up here. Yeah, just to piggyback on that, this is an all hands on deck kind of effort. All these lifts have been, but definitely this one. 
every department in our ski area has chipped in on this project. Lift maintenance, lift ops, a base area team, all of our subcontractors, food and bev feeding us. Everybody's in on this thing. The marketing team telling everybody about it and keeping everybody up to speed. Uh, it's really cool and that's, that's really one of the more satisfying bits about this is working through a project with all these complexities and having everybody jumping in and helping out as much as they have and creating uh, what we believe to be a bitch and lift experience. This is gonna be transformative for our ski area. I uh, can't wait to get everybody up here to check it out. We are very proud of the Lenaway Express. We've been working on this for a long time. We work very closely with our partner, Leitner Palma. It's gonna be a fantastic experience really enhances the skiing. I can't wait for you to come and enjoy it. We can't wait to share that with you, your friends, and your family. So I hope to all see you all here soon.